Oh, now then, my friends, I'm in Benidorm once more, and uh, it's a bit overcast. However, just having a look, about an hour, the sun's going to break through. I can feel it now, actually. It's just coming through the clouds, burning away that cloud. Now then, it's lunchtime, and when I'm back in the UK, there's nothing more that I like. In fact, my mum used to like it. Then Greg's. Everybody loves a Greg's, don't they? Sausage roll, pasties. My mum used to love a cheese and onion pasty. It used to be her favourite. In fact, I always used to take her a couple for lunchtime. That's all she liked. She'd smother it in ketchup and salt, but you know, there we go. Anyway, I thought, well, I'm in Benny Dome. You're not going to get a Greg's, are you? Well, you'd be wrong if you thought you're not going to get a Greg's, because you can get a Greg's right here in Benny Dome. Sort of. There's a Benny Dome's answer to Greg's. I think it's called Simply Delicious. And I went past it yesterday and I have to say it looks absolutely fantastic and I can't wait. They do cheese and onion pasties, they do sausage rolls, they do sandwiches, they do afternoon teas as well, uh, I believe. It looks brilliant. So we're going to head over there now. We're going to mark it out of 10. I want you guys to mark it out of 10 as well. I'm going to sort of like base it on Greg's and see whether it is really Benny Dorm's answer to Greg's. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, click that little bell for notifications as I upload new videos. Now, without further ado, my friends, let's go to Greg's. Socks and flip-flops. That's not good fashion, is it? That's, that's not good fashion. <laughs> now then, I was speaking to a couple yesterday at the corner bar and um, they said curry leaf, which is here, Indian restaurant. Now I've been to Cafe India, which is excellent. And I uh, did a review of that with, um, with Jeff, Jeff Carter. But this curry leaf here, um, the couple said that this, this one was their favorite and they'd been to them all. Have you been to it? Let us know in the comment section down below if you have and tell us what you think. And uh, if you haven't, maybe give it a try and then come back and pop it in the comment section. The only thing I don't like about Greg's, I will have to say, is when you get a pasty, it's cold half the time, isn't it? And I think they do that for the VAT because if it's hot food, I believe, then there's VAT added to it. And if it's cold food, then there isn't. But I'd rather pay a few extra pence and have my food hot. I don't understand it. So there you go. I guess that's why it's cold half the time. I always say, can I, I normally I'll go in and I'll say, which one has just come out of the oven? Because I want something that's hot. And then it's piping hot and it ends up burning your mouth, but there you go. Anyway, what's your favorite Greg's product? It's got to be the sausage roll, I guess, isn't it? Or is it the vegan sausage roll? Controversial, come on. Right, I can see it. Benny Dorm's answer to Greg's. Should I have an apostrophe in it? Benny Dorm's? Well, that would be Benny Dorm is 
answer to Greg's, wouldn't it? What would it be belonging to? I don't know. Anyway, I'm sure there's plenty of people out there who correct people in all the comments. Actually, I think you'll find it spelt this way. Pop it in the comment section down below. Here we go, simply delicious. Benny Dorm's answer to Greg's. Right, I've got to say, this looks absolutely fantastic, this place. I don't think Benny Dorm's answer to Greg's does it any justice, really, because they do so much more than what Greg's does, and their pies look actually, and their pasties look better than Greg's. Um, and I just spoke to the owner, Karen, and she said a lot of people have actually said that. They do airport packs, so rather than pay a fortune in the airport for a sandwich or a roll, like I did with, uh, with uh, Jeff Carter, uh, earlier on a couple of a couple of weeks ago I think it was I paid something like I can't remember what it was you'd have to look back at the video I think it was something like 20 euros near near on 20 euros or 18 euros or something for two terrible rolls ham and cheese rolls and here you can take your own airport back, uh, pack back and have some quality food for on the way to the airport or when you get to the airport or on the plane um, they've got toasters they've got sandwiches they've got jacket potatoes they've got chips they've got everything baguettes it's absolutely fantastic in fact have a look at the menu yourself my friends and i love how they've got this little peg with the menu on like that it's fantastic just have a look my friends Wow, what an extensive menu. It all looks great and I have to say the food looks great in there as well. I will reiterate again, I don't think Benny Dorm's answer to Greg's does this place any justice whatsoever because they have got so, so much on here and it does look great. I've, I've just had a little uh, peek at other people's uh, food. My girlfriend does that, Sarah. In fact, I call her the, uh, the meerkat. She goes, just has a, a little look uh, at what they're having and I've done the same uh, and it looks fantastic. It looks really good. Now, what I normally do go for when I'm at, uh, at Greg's in back in the UK, I'll go for um, a, a ham and cheese salad, I think it is, a ham and cheese salad, and also uh, a cheese and onion pasty. And I always have that as a mark of respect for my mum, who used to love them at Greg's, as I said. So that's what I'm going to go for today. Um, I don't know whether to go for a tea or coffee, though. It's always a bit of a thing. I think tea, really. Tea's a bit more refreshing, although I do fancy a coffee. I don't know, I'll have to think on that one. You'll have to bear with me. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a minute. Right, my friends, so I have ordered. I've ordered a cup of tea, which is coming in a moment, hopefully, fingers crossed. Um, I wonder if it's Yorkshire tea there, that's the thing. I'm gonna have to ask him, I doubt it, but we'll see. Uh, had to order a sausage roll because the lady behind me there said, are you having a sausage roll? Because it's Greg's. And I thought, of course you've got to have a sausage roll, haven't you? So I've gone for the sausage roll. Gone for the cheese and onion pasty as well. Uh, also gone 
for the uh, for the ham and cheese. Thank you very much. You're there we go. There's the tea. Uh, also gone for the ham and cheese baguette. Got some uh, tomatoes on there, or for the American viewers, tomatoes. Got some cucumber grated cheese. The ham looks good on there. Some lettuce underneath as well. There we go. But before we go any further, my friends, you know the score by now. Take a closer look. Right, okay, I think first things first, we will go in for the cheese and onion pasta because that was my mum's favorite. So we're gonna go in for the cheese and onion pasta first and we're gonna cut into that. So let's get the knife. Um, come on then, get in, close in, have a look. Right, okay, so there we go. We've got the, uh, the cheese and onion pasta there. Plenty of cheese in there. This is this is for you, Mum. There we go. Yeah, you did. Because it fits ready, innit? Yeah. Wow. No, it did. It's fun. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's right, yeah. Oh, my word. That, I tell you what, Greg's just definitely does not do it justice. The pastry. Fluffy, flaky. Beautiful airy got like an airy to it airy feeling to it but the cheese got a nice tang to it and the onion that way better than the greg's way better than the greg's mm. mum you'd love that wow okay blimey right let's cut into the sausage roll now this is what Greg's are really famous for, isn't it? Their sausage rolls. Um, there we go. In fact, was it Lad Baby sang about the sausage roll, wasn't it? From Greg's. Right. Here we go. Let's cut into it. Come on, then. I have to keep telling you. Get closer. Right, so there's the sausage roll. Plenty of pastry there. Uh, let's go in for this. Very nice. I prefer the cheese and onion pasty, but very nice. The pastry, not too greasy at all. Spot on. Right, now, I have this. I have the baguette at uh, lunchtimes back in the UK. And I have to say this looks in a different league. Um, the ham looks a lot better. Wow, the baguette's nice and crispy. Now, I was gonna cut this in half, but the lady behind me there, she said, she said bird, but I'm not going to call her a bird. Say the bird behind me. No, the lady behind me said, I've got to say, don't cut it in half. Go big or go home. So we're going to go, go in for this. Here we go. Are we ready? I'm not beard meets food, you know. <laughs> Here we go. Mmm. Wow. Okay. That baguette is amazing. Crunchy on the really crunchy on the outer, but the bread on it on the inside is so fresh. And the ham, absolutely fantastic. Fresh salad, fresh tomatoes, fresh lettuce, everything about this is superb. I've got my tea here as well. I've probably left the tea bag in too long here. So we're going to take the tea bag out. There we go. 
Look at this. Pop the milk in there. Okay. Oh, hang on a minute. I put my tea bag there, look, on the side. You can tell I'm from Mansfield, can't you? That is for the tea bag. There we go. That's what you do. Right, let's taste this. I don't think this is Yorkshire tea, though. Got to see what tea it is. I don't think it's Yorkshire, but very tasty. Oh, I love a cup of tea and a baguette. What more do you want? It's fantastic, yeah. This is way better than Greg's. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a minute. Right, my friends. Okay, so there we go. Benny Dorm's answer to Greg's. Really, I don't think it does it justice. Um, the only thing I'd change is, the only thing I would change is, of course, um, I'd go and have Yorkshire tea, because I said, uh, what tea was it? They said, Tetley's. But Tetley's is good. You know, some people prefer Tetley's, but I, they said they might get it in. They said, oh, we'll have to look at that then. I said, yeah, get Yorkshire tea. Anyway, let's move on, because it's not about the tea. Um, the cheese and onion pasta was fantastic. It was really, really nice. The pastry on that was fantastic. The, uh, the cheese in it was tangy. The onion had got a little zing to it as well. Got a little kick. It was gorgeous. Thoroughly enjoyed that. And as I said, my mum would have loved that. Um, that was way better than Greg's. The sausage roll, yeah, the sausage roll was nice. I'd have had the sausage a little bit bigger in it, but it's the same as Greg's, isn't it, that? But, uh, the, and, but for me, the Fiesta Resistance was the baguette. Wow, absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, the, the ham was fantastic. The lettuce, fresh. The tomatoes, fresh. Everything in there looks spot on. I tell you what though, if I wasn't going for something else to eat later on, to review, I'd have gone back in there and I've had, uh, I'd have had the, uh, one of their um, cheesecakes or maybe even uh, a little chocolate eclair. The, the desserts look fantastic as well. Somebody actually had a jacket potato while I was there as well, while I was uh, filming. And it looked spot on because there's nothing worse than a jacket potato that hasn't been cooked properly. And they've got a proper jacket potato oven in there. And it was, oh yeah, it was, it was nice. It was a crispy outer, you know, so you could eat the skin on the jacket potato. And it was looked, looked nice, light and fluffy on the inside. It was great. I tell you what, what a fantastic place. Fast internet as well. You can sit in there. It's great. I love it. And uh, don't forget, you can actually get yourself some uh, sandwiches made or whatever made up to go to the airport. And that'll save you money for when you get into the airport and for on the plane ride as well, for your plane journey, your flight on the plane, plane ride. Anyway, so there you go. Benny Dorm's answer to Greg's. And I tell you what, simply delicious. It is simply delicious. Uh, I'll pop their details in the description down below. They said if you want anything, they'll, they'll make it for you. So you can't get better than that, can you? For me, it's a 10 all day, every day. Really enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, the only thing is, I just said to her, I, don't, I wouldn't call it if anyone's answer to Greg's because it ain't, it's better. But I guess it's, a, it's an advertising thing, isn't it? But pay them a visit because it is, it's way better than Greg's. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Sun's come out now, told you. See you later. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click that thumbs up as well. Give it a thumb up. It's free. Don't cost you out. My mum used to say, not subscribing to anything. It cost me money. Don't cost out. Subscription's free. Bye bye. Oh, and it was 12 euros 30. Just looking at my Revolut. 12 euros and 30. Bargain. And that was with the tea as well. That's the tea, cheese and onion pasty, sausage roll, and that blooming great baguette that was big. Anyway, I'm off. Bye bye.